What's going on guys, it's your average consumer and today, thankfully, we've got another massive tech unboxing and this is number 31. Now, we are stuck at home guys, so things have been a bit slower. We haven't been able to do a massive tech unboxing, what, last year? I mean, last month. <laughs> everything's all jumbled up. Last month, I don't think we did a massive tech unboxing, so we are finally back. Uh, we don't have the whole crew here, I just got my baby boot. Ari. Hi. You down? I'm you down. Ready for this? I'm trying to hold this heavy Ari, camera. Ari's gonna be the one, the, the camera woman for this, so it's gonna be a little bit rough. Wow. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but guys, you know the deal. Grab your snacks, grab your drinks, because thankfully, we got a bunch of packages to open up. All right, Ari, you know the deal. What you want first, boo? Let's see. Let's just go. I'm just gonna make it easy for you. This one, this big one. No, I'm just no, kidding. No, I'm no, kidding. No, okay, no. let's go with that one. <laughs> trying to be Jay over here. And just a heads up, guys. About 75% of these are from the PO box. So if you see boxes disappear, just know they weren't worth your time. And I'm using my modeling kit uh, knife over here. It's not even like a regular unboxing knife. I'm so ill-equipped over here. Okay, so uh, what are we starting off with? Are we starting off strong? Okay. This is the Samsung Galaxy S20 LED back cover. All right, so we got an S20 over here. This is the LED case. Okay, so this is what pops up when you throw it on. Shows you that you get some wallpapers and shortcuts and stuff. We'll start, we'll agree to everything. Allow, allow, allow. Uh, let's put on the camera, kind of show you guys some of the stuff it can do. So if I wanted to take a picture of Ari, did you see anything? Did it say like a three, two, one? No. Let's see. Let's see if I put a timer on here. So like, let's say a five. That would make sense. A five second timer. Yeah. You see something? Yeah. Ah. That's cute. Boom. And I believe you can see like little notification lights if some notifications were to come in. Ah. Oh, snap. Look at that. That looks really cool. This is it with, with it just off. Do you remember back in the day when people would change out their covers and stuff and you can see the inside of the phone? and it would light up. Oh, really? Yeah, you didn't have that? No. Oh. You know, I had a sidekick back in the day. I didn't need all that. <laughs> Changing out covers and whatnot. But this is cool, I like this. I like the way the case feels. It's nice and compact, feels good in the hand, and it's made by Samsung, so that's dope. Oh, I just cleaned this place, and it's about to become a mess. Let's go for- Let's do this one. This? Yeah, I'm just curious because it didn't come in a box. It just came in bubble wrap and a label. <laughs> it came in bubble wrap. This is from the P.O. box. What comes in the P.O. box is like the Wild Wild West. You don't know what you get in there. All right, so this is the Lumio Sonic Electric Toothbrush. Ooh. So here's what we've got. Okay, so this is the toothbrush itself, I guess. Oh, oh. snap. <laughs> How do I get it back down, though? Okay, I have no idea how to bring it back down. Do you just push it? No, you don't just push it down. Okay, so that's that for right now. Let's see what else we got. We have the micro USB cable. Oh, micro USB. And I'm guessing this is what charges it. You throw it up on here. And then this is a brush hair. So you get another, you know, brush. That's cool. I like how compact it is. Yeah, it's good for travel, it looks like. But I just don't. Oh, there we go. Well, you got a double tap or something? I'm not gonna go through it again and try to find out. Uh, but this is cool, I like it. It's like sealed off at the top too, so you don't have to worry about anything touching it. So in terms of electric toothbrushes, I like that feature because you always have to put a cap on the actual brush when traveling, so this is nice. Let's see what else we got here. Let's go for something big. How about that? So this I'm, I'm interested in seeing. We got this from our friends over at Gigabit. I feel like I'm doing surgery here. How you doing, Ari? Sorry, I'm okay. You all right? I'm You're just good? not as tall as Jay, so. Oh, so it's kind of hard to see? All right, yeah. all right, all right. Let me try and make your life a little bit easier over here. All right. All right, guys, so right here, we have the Aorus RTX 2080 Ti gaming box. And with this guy, you're gonna be able to plug this thing into a laptop with like a Thunderbolt port, and you get access to a 2080 Ti graphics card, making you able to game a lot better than what you would get on a regular laptop, because usually they don't have graphics cards as powerful as this. All right, so let's pop this thing open. Ooh, like I said, this thing works for laptops, so I guess if you wanna carry it around, boom, you get a nice travel case to go with it. It's smaller than I thought it would be. 
Yeah, actually, yeah, me too. The box makes it look kind of big, but it's not. Oh man, that's nice. And it comes with a bunch of ports in the back. You of course get some display ports. Over here you get two, you get an HDMI. You actually have three display ports. So if you have a laptop and you wanna have like a crazy triple monitor system of some sort, you'll be able to pull it off with this guy. You also have USB type C port over here, ethernet, Thunderbolt port, and two USB 3.0 ports or 3.1, and the power, and of course a fan. Now it's interesting, it has a fan, but this guy is also water cooled. So not only do you have like the fan to, you know, for the thermals, but you have water cooling so that it's even more efficient in terms of keeping that temperature down and quiet. And you get an extra USB port up front. How about that? Uh, but if you guys want to see something done with this, like maybe a setup video of some sort, let me know with a comment down below. This thing looks kind of dope and I am very, very interested in trying it out with a few of the laptops that we have around here. All right, next up. Oh, oh yes, okay. So this is something I'm really, really excited about because I actually reached out to this company. So this is Villager Supplies 3UP Switch Sling Bag. So it is a sling. You, I think there's a, probably a strap in here where you can just kind of throw this over your shoulder. And of course there is. Uh, but one thing that really attracted me to this is not only does it look good, but take a look inside. The materials look great. You can carry around accessories inside of here. So you can throw in your games up in here and you throw in your switch right inside of here. Feels good. So over here you have your spots for your accessories. So you can throw in cables and whatever things that you might want for your switch. You can have it all inside of here. You even have another little spot in the back to throw more things into. But you have like multiple ways of carrying it. You have the sling over here as well as this little wrist strap. I'll cut this thing open and then I'll uh, show you guys on like Instagram or something, but this thing looks dope. I love it. Huge shout out to uh, Villager Supplies for sending this out. I think they also sent out a t-shirt. Boom. Villager Supplies. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> yeah, you didn't expect that, right? At all. <laughs> Super minimal in the front. <laughs> all right, so now I wanna get rid of this giant box that's right here. Yeah. So let's just do that. I think this is also from Gigabit. Oh. That's not from Gigabit. Nope. <laughs> it's uh, Did you order this? Yeah, it's, it's, yeah. Oh, okay. Well, we stand corrected. Waste of a big box. <laughs> P.O. box, so let's see what this is. Wireless Go, compact wire, oh, okay. Compact wireless microphone system from Rode. Oh, nice, that's actually This is actually awesome. something that could be really useful for us. <laughs> I've heard about that too when I was researching for mine. Oh, really? It's like a wireless um, lav, so and the mic is the built in. Yeah, it looks like, so you see the picture of the girl here using it. She's vlogging and she's got this uh, thing hanging right here. Let's just take a quick look at it. And whoa, these are way smaller than I thought. She must be a small girl on that box because that thing looked gigantic on her. <laughs> okay, and it uses USB type C. I like that. And you can throw this little windscreen on here too. So when you're outside and the wind is you know, blowing over the microphone, you won't hear it like that. It has really good reviews online. Does it? Mm -hmm. All right, well, there you go, guys. All right, so over here, we have an Amazon Echo Dot. Never seen one of those before. <laughs> but this time, it has a digital clock built right into it. So these days, without cable, I don't know how many of you guys have cable boxes or not. We don't have cable boxes in our homes, and when I was growing up, that's usually what you looked at to get the time. And you know, you just don't have like these digital clocks anymore. You don't really have something you could just shoot your eyes over it and see the, the time. So I like this. Yeah, I can see these. You don't sound convinced, <laughs> are you? Like it's just another echo dot. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, whatever, all right. Well, I, I think it's kind of cool though. All right, gotta open up the rest of these boxes quickly. My pregnant wife is ready to kill me, I'm sure. <laughs> Side track, love your work wherever you work. So this is one of those, uh, extra screens that you can throw onto a laptop. So you like have a laptop screen and then you add this piece to it with a sliding screen that comes out on the side. What? I have never seen that. I've never seen one in person, but I've heard about these online. So it's supposed to give you an additional display or something? So it gives you like, so you'll have like a two monitor display with your laptop. Oh, are, are these like adhesives? Oh, okay. So I won't be testing this just yet. 
<laughs> I gotta make sure I know what I wanna put it on. Let me just at least show you guys. So if you have your laptop, right? The idea here is to attach it when you have the laptop open. You have it like this, of course, but when you want to, you can pull out a second screen. I think it's cool, but I don't know if I'd want that extra weight on my laptop though. I would like put that on a work laptop. A work <laughs> laptop, yeah. yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, what are the specs on this guy though? I'm just kind of curious. Love showing off cookie, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's 1080p, uses USB type C, and it's a 12.5 inch display. I'm gonna, I'm going to attach it to a laptop and I'll let you guys know what I think. Maybe put it on Instagram or something. There you go. Life Fuels, the smart nutrition bottle that adapts to your day. Cool. We've been drinking a lot of water around here. We have. So this thing has hydration tracking, 30 beverages per fuel pod. It has a fuel pod? Oh, snap, guys, what? it has a fuel pod. I am ridiculously excited right now. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, what is it? All right, so this is the bottle itself. Feels high quality. And, but the bottom though, you see right here, guys? This is where you have access to your fuel pods. <laughs> <laughs> so. Listen, I'm only making fun because Ari is just is enamored by the word fuel pods. I am. Uh, but it could be something that's actually legit. What oh, flavors snap. do we have? All oh right. my god, this is amazing. Check this out. So we got strawberry mango, cranberry raspberry, and uh, blackberry lime. Now is that to like just flavor your water? I think it's supposed to give you fuel. <laughs> Oh, and it has like, this one has like electrolytes. This one has antioxidants and that one is what? That, those are vitamins A, B, Oh, those C. are vitamins. So I guess depending on what you need. So if you need to get your electrolytes up, like you're going for a run or something, boom. But you said 75 calories in this thing. It must add a lot of flavor because it, it's flavored. Well, Ari, um, so. This I, is the point where you say, well, you could have it, Ari. I was just about to say it, but now. Yeah. <laughs> now, now, I don't know. Some sound a little entitled. <laughs> now nah, you can have it, dude. Thank you. Oh, they call this the vessel gasket. Oh, man. <laughs> All right, so we took a look at this, and it's actually just five calories per serving. What it does is it just shoots a little bit of, I guess, the fuel pods <laughs> into, the, into the water that you put in here, and then it mixes it. So, and then so you... the whole bottle has 75, but each serving that you split out has mm, five. Right. Oh, that makes, it, that makes it even cooler, because then you can just kind of pick and choose what you need in the moment. Right. Like, I need electrolytes. Psst. This is dope. Aren't you lucky, Ari? <laughs> oh, snap, a 12 volt jump starter and power bank. Weren't we just talking about we getting were, one? We were just talking about getting a jump starter. Wow. <laughs> what are the chances of that? I don't know. Jump starter car up to 20 times per charge. And it comes with a nice fancy case. Got your jump starter cables. That's right, it actually looks pretty clean. Mm -hmm. This is where you plug in the cables. You have your USB ports and a flashlight. Boom. USB-C, DC in to charge. This is nice and compact though. I like this. Oh, snap. Okay. Oh my gosh. So we got a lot more road stuff over here. We got the road pins, another road wireless go. Lav, magnetic clip for this. Oh, we got a whole mic. I'm guessing this is like a travel pouch. Oh, it's like a little tote bag. Okay, cool. They hooks you up, babe. I know, right? About to get my vlogging back on. Boo. I was about to say, wanna become a vlogger? Let's go. You ready to bring your average couple back? Make Put a little wireless mic on the baby. <laughs> your average family, you know? So thank you, Road, for sending all this over. Okay, so dual USB charger with USB PD. Wow, 65 watts? And this little thing? That's actually pretty impressive. You can charge a laptop with this, guys. What? Yeah, 65 watts. That's more that than- That means nothing to me. <laughs> but you can charge a laptop. You can charge a laptop with this if it has USB, uh, USB-C. Just to put it in perspective, the Dell XPS that we've been using, the 13, mm -hmm. that one has a 45 watt charger. Oh, wow. So it's a 65 watt charger, so you know, can charge that up with no problem. And it's so compact. It's much smaller than the charging cable that it has. All right, lots of P.O. Box stuff. We got more Aki chargers, guys. <laughs> All right, thanks Aki. These are great. So we've got these L-shaped uh, charging cables. Gracias. Oh, this is from Spigen. Okay. 
Galaxy S20 cases. iPhone S SE, maybe? Nah, it's gotta be S20, S20 Ultra. You see all these? And your boy is right. Of course. S20 Ultra. So we got a bunch of different Spigen cases over here. Love speaking cases. Let's see what else they got. So this is their Flex wireless charger, some USB-C to USB-C 2.0 cable. You got a small, oh, a small hand warmer. Hand warmer and power bank. So it's 5,000 milliamp hours. But this thing is also a hand warmer. Have you ever seen that as part I've of a never. power bank? Oh, this thing needs to be charged first. No. But this is cool though. So if you're, you know, it's winter time and you want to go ahead and uh, keep your hands warm, Use a power bank. This stuff is great. Now I get to switch up my Galaxy S20 cases. All right, moving on. Okay, so now we got this guy. Oh. That's a nice box. Yeah, I wish I opened this one earlier. I know, I should have done that one first. Okay, but SteelSeries sent over some keyboards. So we have the Apex 3 and the Apex 5. Now SteelSeries has some dope keyboards because take a look at it over here, guys. They've got this cool little LED screen right on the keyboard itself. Oh, you use this in the studio. Yeah, I have the uh, I have the 7 though, I believe it's oh, okay. called. Guys, he puts a Gundam image in that little LED. Yes, <laughs> yes I do. It's actually, I brought it home. That's how much I like it. It's over there. Wait a minute, this is IP32 water resistant? So that means if you're, I guess, playing your games and you spill something on your keyboard, you're not screwed completely. This is actually kind of cool. Now, if you're spilling stuff on your keyboard, shame on you, uh, but, if, you're, if you happen to do it a lot, then you got an option out here to protect yourself. And they also sent over one of their gaming mice. This is the Rival 3. All right, gotta love some uh, SteelSeries stuff. What do we have here? Ha, ah, congrats on pending fatherhood. Aww. Aww, SteelSeries. That's so nice. So the Rival 3 is just 30 bucks. The Apex 3, the water resistant one is $49.99, which oh, is actually, wow. that's a pretty good price. And the Apex 5 is 100 bucks. Nice. I'll be checking these out for sure. And last but not least, <laughs> it's not even tech. We're not even ending off on some crazy tech, actually. All right, this is something I actually picked up from my boy Jacques Slade. I'll have his YouTube channel down below. I am not a sneakerhead by any means, but I've, I've gotten a few kicks recently. You guys have seen them on the Massive Tech Unboxings. And he, I think, did a collaboration with Container Store. And these are like the perfect things to put your sneakers in. This is just like amazing. Ooh. So you just pop it open, throw your kicks in there. That's fancy. And boom. And there, what's nice is that these are stackable. So you can just go boop. I bought the six pack. So you guys can see there's like four more inside of here. Did you only buy one box of them? Oh, no, no, no. I was about to say, you have a lot of sneakers. We, we, we have a lot more coming. So I don't have that many sneakers, but I got enough to, you know, put all my sneakers inside of. I'll say that. <laughs> I'm sure there's some kind of tech use for this. Maybe put your... No, nah, there's no tech use for it. <laughs> <laughs> but that's about it, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. I think this was some pretty cool stuff. I know, Ari, you're a pump for the... Uh... The water bottle? Oh, yeah. This is going to be cool. Uh, I'm happy about this guy. We got lots of cool stuff this time around, guys. If you enjoyed the video, be the cool guy or girl that gives it a thumbs up. I'm gonna catch you guys in the next one. Thankfully, we were able to do a massive tech unboxing. And let's give Ari a huge shout out for holding this heavy camera. Yeah, thank you, thank you very My much. baby boy probably suffering in there like, yo, <laughs> no. make her put those things down. All right, I'll take it. Later, guys. <laughs>